Okay, everyone, in this video, I'm gonna do a virtual tour of the best condos and houses in Phuket that are listed on the FazWise website right now, ranging from one bedrooms to three bedrooms with a sales price starting from 3.4 million baht to 24 million baht, and a rent price starting from 40,000 baht to 75,000 baht. And if you're looking to buy or rent a place anywhere in Thailand, see the description of this video for how to get started. And with that, we're gonna get started with a, a virtual tour of the first place. So the first place that I'm gonna show you is a one bedroom, one bathroom, 52.8 square meters in size on the second floor of Babylon Sky Garden, which was completed in September of 2018. Uh, this place is for sale for 3.4 million baht, bringing the price per square meter to 64,000 baht per square meter. So this place is located south of the Phuket island on near Rawai Beach. I'm going to show you a map view here. So yeah, it's right on the southern tip here, faces eastward, so you're going to see the a gorgeous sunrise. And uh, yeah, so I'm going to show you a walkthrough of the unit itself. Now, if you want to see the facilities and the project itself, I encourage you to see the links in the description of this video to uh, see these listings and take your time and view the place on your own. But in this video, I'm just going to breeze through all these listings and just show you the unit. So let's jump into a 3D walkthrough of this place. And then first of all, I'm going to start off by zooming up to give you the layout of the floor plan. So you, from the entrance, you've got a living room area here and then you've got uh, access to the bathroom to the right which also takes you into the bedroom and you can see that it has a gigantic uh, balcony as well that I'm gonna show you so I'm gonna jump into the entrance first and uh, my first impression is I, I really like this clean minimal uh, kind of uh, white flooring and paint it gives you this uh, really nice uh, beach cottage vibe to it and <laughs> Jeez, that is a gorgeous view from uh, the living room there. You can see that uh, this is a beachfront property and you get a view of the beach there. So we'll get to that in a second. But first of all, let's have a look at the kitchen. Okay, yeah, I really like this wooden finishing here. Very clean, this kind of like sand-like color. And I really like this uh, dark, uh, sturdy countertop that contrasts very well with it. And you've got an electric stove here, that's nice. And then behind you, you've got some extra cabinetry as well. Okay, and then you've got a little bit of space here for a dining area for two. And then you've got a living room here, but I can't wait to see uh, the balcony because this is the main selling point of this place. It's got a very, very large balcony, which I imagine you're gonna spend a lot of your time out here because it's giving you this gorgeous view uh, of the beach. And then you've got some greenery uh, beyond there. So this is a fantastic view for uh, this place starting at 3.4 million bots. Okay, they've got a sunbed out for you, giving you an idea of what to do with this balcony. I'm sure you're going to spend time uh, on this balcony a lot as well. And this balcony also takes you into the master bedroom, okay, which comes with a decent size, large bed. Again, I, I like the congruence of the finishing here, this kind of like light wood furniture. That's really, really nice, very clean. And it comes with a TV here, and uh, it comes with a sliding closet with a full mirror a nice modern clean looking bathroom with a shower okay and that comes with a shower head as well so that's very nice so zooming up this place babylon uh, on the second floor really nice uh, 3.4 million baht gives you a huge balcony that lets you enjoy that amazing uh, beach view there so for those of you who want want to live in phuket and be next to the beach this place is a great option that's why it's in this video Okay, so the next place I have for you is actually a house for rent. I know a lot of you have been looking for houses to rent, not necessarily you know to buy a condo, but you want a place. And the one I got for you is a four bedroom, three bathroom, 250 square meters in size, two stories. It's called Oyster Cove Villas. Uh, the house was completed in January of 2017, and it's available per month for one year contract at 40,000 baht. Now, this place 
the reason why I chose this too, because there's plenty of houses for rent in Phuket, obviously, is because this one is also uh, located right next to the beach. So you're gonna get a beach ocean view from this place as well. It's, uh, it's also on the southern tip of the island as well. This is uh, Cape Banwa, which is actually one of my favorite areas in Phuket. I think it's gorgeous, very peaceful. You're very close to Shalong Bay area as well, and Phuket Old Town is right here. I love Phuket Old Town, very cultural, and I love the food there. I think southern food in Phuket is fantastic. So let's jump into a 3D walkthrough of this place. Uh, we're gonna spend a little bit of time here because it's got two floors, and then uh, as you start off here, it, it gives you a view of the living room with that gorgeous view of the sea. So uh, that's a great selling point, but we'll get to that in a second. Let's start off in the first floor, actually, as you come in from uh, the entrance right here. Okay, so you've got the entrance, you've got two bedrooms on the first floor, uh, you've got a few balconies as well, and then uh, you've got a stairway back here that leads you to the second floor. So uh, let's uh, walk in as if we were a guest to view this place. And then to the left is a convenient storage room, which uh, this person converted into a kid's room with a bunk bed. That's really nice, giving you some options and what to do with it and then followed by the next room, which is the first bed bedroom that comes with its own uh, ensuite bathroom with a shower, as you can see here, yep. Okay, what's, what's that? Is that a screen that leads? Okay, no, it's just a little uh, uh, opaque screen that separates uh, the bedroom. So, okay, wow, okay. So, it's got a bed that faces uh, that gorgeous uh, view of Shalong Bay right there. That's a really, really nice view that you're gonna see the sunset. You're actually facing west with this property. So, you're gonna see a gorgeous sunset uh, here and then it comes with a really nice balcony for you to hang out and I really like that the bed faces the view most pl places for some reason I don't know why they don't face the view they just face away from the view but um, this gives you this really nice romantic feeling and I like this uh, large floor to ceiling uh, mirror as well and um, you can also turn this into a little um, office space as well you know what maybe I'll shoot some uh, property reviews uh, from this this vantage point here. That would be pretty cool. Anyway, zooming up uh, Let's have a look at the second bedroom. Okay uh, Okay, not as nice of a bedroom in terms of a view But it also gives you a balcony as well. Yep. Well, I mean it's a good view as well But it's not as a, as a as front row as the first one. So uh, This here. Okay, so it's an enclosed space so you can either uh, use this as a balcony, outdoor balcony, or close uh, the screens here, and this can be an extension of your room as well. So that's good that it gives you that optionality. Yeah, these these kind of like light, light brown wood furniture kind of date the place a little bit, even though it was built in 2017. I wish they would put in a little more either just plain old like lighter color, way, way lighter, like sand color or dark wood to contrast with the uh, white walls, but that's just me nitpicking. Uh, let's have a look at the bathroom. Okay, yeah, another bathroom, uh, three-piece bathroom with a shower. And then uh, let's walk up the stairway here to the second floor, which is where uh, this place, uh, I bet, really shines. So you arrive at the living room right here. So a dedicated living room comes with, uh, this place comes furnished with all the couches and this TV here. And um, what makes this place really shine is this area that gives you a floor to ceiling view, very open, very, gives you all this natural light coming in open view of uh, Shalong Bay right here. So this is a great area. <laughs> they even put in um, some seating for you to sit there and enjoy the sunset, which I imagine a lot of you are gonna do if you rent this place out. And it's got its own little uh, corner kitchen area with a bar. Uh, so plenty of area, plenty of space for you to prepare your food. Uh, the kitchen comes with an oven and a washing machine as well. Plenty of cabinetry overhead and at the bottom. And then uh, what else we got? We've got a guest toilet right here as well, which does not have a shower, but uh, it's just a toilet for you to use. Okay, what else we got? And then, uh, yeah, so that's the extent of it. Uh, can we walk out? Let's see. 
Okay, so there's no balconies on the second floor, but uh, there's plenty of windows that brings in natural light and allows you to see this gorgeous view. So this place, the Oyster Cove Villas, uh, available for rent for 40,000 bots a month. That is if you sign a one-year contract. If you want one to mo uh, month to month, maybe negotiate with them on that. So. Moving on to the next place, we're back to condos. So we're, we're back to a two bedroom, two bathroom, 77 square meters in size uh, on the fourth floor of the Title Rarai Phase 3, which was completed in 2016. This place is for sale for 7.9 million baht with a price per square meter of 102,000 baht per square meter. So let's jump into a walkthrough of this place. Oh wait, before I do that, I gotta show you where it is. Okay, so this place is also located, uh, let's see, on the southern tip of the island as well, but on towards the west, because the, the previous place was uh, around here, and this place is located on this uh, southern tip here, which is, this area is called Rawai as well, yep. So that's the same area as the first condo in this video. So let's do a 3D walkthrough. All right, entering the full screen. So you can see here that, okay, so you've got a common area in the middle, and then you've got, uh, which is sandwiched by two bedrooms, and then you've got a large balcony here. So jumping in, yep, okay. So you've got a kitchen area both to the right and uh, let's say to the left as well. Okay, to the left is just uh, some uh, shelving to put your books or uh, anything. But then the kitchen is right here on the right, okay. Um, yeah, I wish they did a little bit better with the uh, cabinetry here. It looks a little um, cheap, but hey, I mean, th this place is for sale, so you can furnish it however you want. And then you've got an uh, area in the middle here uh, with a dining table. I really like the, the, this floor here. I think the color really pops and contrasts really well with this off-white, sand-ish white color of the walls and the ceiling. Okay. And then in the middle is uh, your living room. And then that leads to the balcony. Now this place does not give you a view of the ocean, but it's actually very, very close to Rawai Beach. I think it's uh, over yonder there. Uh, don't quote me on that. But it's got this um, really large balcony that connects with both uh, the guest bedroom and the master bedroom. So let's look at the first bedroom first. Jumping in, yep. Okay, just a pretty decent uh, bedroom. <laughs> They've stacked their <laughs> outdoor chairs here. Okay, nice. And that and that leads to um, your. So you've got a closet here, and that leads to your um, uh, bathroom here. Yeah, which is uh, comes with a shower, with normal shower head and a rain shower. I like this uh, large mirror here. And okay, it comes with a washing machine right there. Okay. And then zooming up and jumping into the master bedroom, a bit larger, comes with a TV. And then uh, the master uh, has this view of the trees outside, so that's really nice. Also kind of same layout, comes with the same uh, closet as well. And uh, let's check out the bathroom. So the, bath the master bathroom comes with a master bathtub as well that has a little opening for for you to get some fresh air in so that's really nice okay and then you've got a shower here with the rain shower head as well so all right so zooming up this place title rawai phase three for 7.9 million baht close to rawai beach Next, we move on to a two bedroom, two bathroom, 157 square meters in size. So we're going up in size now. These places are getting larger. On the third floor of San Suri, which was completed in 2014. This place is for sale for 15.5 million baht, bringing the price per square to 98,000 baht per square meter. Now this place, you can also rent it for 35,000 baht per month, so that's not not bad. Uh, this place is located in Sheng Tale, which is on the, um, I'm not, I don't know, the, on the west side of the island. I don't know all my Phuket beaches offhand. I don't really live there, so I have to refer to the map. So really well situated. And so let's jump into a walkthrough of this place. 
Full screen, okay, all right, so this is gonna give you a longer layout, which, uh, okay, I'm not a huge fan of because along here, you're not gonna really gonna have windows, but they are compensating for that by giving you a great view all the way over there, which is okay, I guess. So you come in from the entrance, and then you've got a, a nice uh, U-shaped, full-size Western kitchen that comes with a oven and uh, washing machine as well. Plenty of countertop to prepare your food and plenty of storage space uh, overhead here. Lots of cabinetry. And uh, this, and it has this uh, large uh, area in the middle here just to uh, fit your dining set. And it's got this uh, really nice uh, Florida ceiling uh, mirrors to give you uh, a feeling of even more space. This place with all its white floors, white ceilings, and white walls is a uh, blank canvas for anyone who wants to decorate it with any color that pops, such as this um, painting over here. And then it leads to this uh, rather large living area here as well. And then it goes further to this balcony that gives you a uh, view of the beach over there. So you've got a view of some green, greenery to the right here. Lots of co uh, coconut trees and uh, banana trees, uh, greenery over there. And over there is uh, the ocean. So that's really nice. Then you've got the communal pool here, which I do not encourage you to jump in on a Friday night when you're drunk because it's you're going to break your ankle. Okay. And so this balcony connects to the master bedroom here, so which is a pretty large, space, spacious master bedroom. I actually like uh, this this theme they got with the lotus paintings here, and <laughs> they match the pillows with the painting. That's really cute of them. So that's really nice that they've uh, made the colors kind of pop. So you've got you know that one there and uh, that one in the master there as well. So that's a really nice addition. Uh, I wish there were more furniture, that to, darker furniture to contrast, but you can put it there if you want. So you've got a really large um, bespoke fitted wardrobe, it says. And uh, to the right here is a desk area. And then the master bathroom comes with a shower, large uh, mirrors here and a uh, his and her vanity counter two sinks and then a, a Toilet over there. Does it come with a bathtub? Hmm. No, it does not. Okay Okay, so Larger place, but does not come with a bathtub. Okay Okay, let's check out the other bedroom and so you'll use this uh, bathroom here where the guests will use and then they'll uh, Use this for your shower as well, and I like these large mirrors and then just uh, giving you a glimpse of uh, the guest bedroom. Yep, okay, another really nice uh, flower painting as well. I like that they are keeping to this um, theme. Okay, and then large uh, sliding wardrobes with large mirrors. And this looks outwards into towards the uh, project area. Okay, so this is sensory two bedroom for 15.5 million baht, very close to the beach. All the places that I'm showing you in this video are very close to the beach, and most of it, four out of five, give you a like direct view of the ocean. Okay, moving on to a three bedroom, three bathroom, 205 square meters in size on the fourth floor of Marina Living Condo. This project was completed in 2016 and it's on sale for 24.8 million baht, bringing the price per square to 120,000 baht per square meter. It's located in Ba. Phuket, which is, I have to check the map again. All right, so uh, the previous place was on, was on the west side of the island. This place is on the east side of the island, so a lot of options for you here, so, um, depending on uh, which side of the island you prefer. So the first places were on the southern tips here. The fourth place, the last one there was on this west side, and this place is on the northeast. That's very close to uh, the Phuket Marina area, which is a really uh, cool place to hang out. So let's jump into a 3D virtual tour of this place. Wow, okay. They've surely decorated this place uh, with this like very uh, ocean uh, aquarium <laughs> kind of style theme to it, uh, which I think is cool. They've got a little seashell collection, and I really like these um, 
uh, old school sail ship uh, models there. That's really nice. I hope that's included. Should be included. You can request for them to include it. It's part of the bargain. And then, okay, so you jump here. So you've got your bedrooms on opposite sides, one here, and then you come in here and then you've got a few balconies. So lots to see here. This place is, um, you know, a lot more furnished than the previous place, has more character to it as I'm seeing so far. So let's jump in from the entrance. So you've got an entrance from a private elevator. Why not? If you're paying 24 million, yeah, having a private elevator is one of the perks you're gonna get. Yep, nice. I like these um, dark wood uh, screens here. That gives it a lot of character. Wow, it has a little, a little bit of a pirate theme to it too, which is I, I think is cool. Okay, all right, so that overlooks some greenery there. And then, okay, these little doors open up into the living room area. Okay, very nice. Uh, has some character to it. And then, uh, uh, what's this? You've got a balcony over here that overlooks a uh, really nice green lawn area. That's really cool. Okay, yeah, very, very large living room area. So, living room area here, another living room area here. Yeah, and then these shelves for your uh, seashell and ship collection that uh, hopefully you can inherit from the seller. I really like this uh, color play between the off-white and the dark brown and this uh, blue and the blues they have here. It gives you this beach penthouse kind of vibe to it. Really, really classy in my opinion. I really dig this and uh, cool. And then you've got this kitchen area with a large bar area. So this place is perfect for uh, entertaining a large group of guests for your parties. And uh, let's have a look at the kitchen area. Okay, wow, this place is <laughs> lots to see. <laughs> I'm, I'm being pulled in all these different directions. Uh, I like this um, yet yeah, nautical theme. So this is the first guest bathroom here. Okay, nice, very nice and modern as well. And then looking at the, okay, so you've got an electric stove right here on the bar. Wow, so you can do some exhibitionist style uh, uh, cooking. That's really nice. And then you've got a sink and then some uh, cabinetry down below as well. So this is great. Wow, I'm loving this place a lot. And then you've got this uh, gorgeous dining uh, room area here, surrounded by all this uh, fabulous decor, map of England. And then don't forget to the floor to ceiling windows letting in that very uh, bright natural lighting. And uh, there's the view of the sea right there. So let's step out to the balcony. First balcony here gives you a view of uh, the greenery here and the sea beyond. And you've got the marina there and it comes with a jacuzzi. How decadent. And it's keeping to the theme with the blues. That's really cool. Okay. Nice, wow, I just, I just love looking at this place. I, I, th I, I personally think they did a great job furnishing this place. It has a lot of character. Like I said, it gives you this like beach nautical vibe to it. Um, yeah, very nice. So let's uh, jump up and have a look at uh, yeah, some of the bedrooms. So let's check out bedroom number three first, the smallest of them all. Yep, okay. Nice, and it gives you a view of uh, the lawn area, the project. Yep, cool. And then uh, it's got this little closet here, and then yeah, some space here as well. And then a uh, bathroom with a shower. Is that just a shower head? Okay, no, so it's got a normal shower with a shower head here as well. Nice, and then zooming up to the second bedroom. Great, this place is gorgeous. So, okay, map of France, very congruent with the decor. I like that. I like when people stick to a theme and this place sticks to it very well. So you've got the grass lawn area. That's very nice, some mountains in the distance. Yeah, and uh, same color theme throughout the entire project. Very nice, uh, 100 points to Gryffindor for the person who decorated this place. Very nice. All right, let's check out the master bedroom. Boom, so the master bedroom stands out because of its view of the ocean as well there, the marina. 
That is fantastic waking up to that. So uh, that faces east. So you're gonna get a view of the sunrise coming up here in the morning, waking up to that. It's gonna be very refreshing. Uh, you've got a walk-in closet in the master bedroom, of course, why not? How decadent. And then the uh, master bathroom, okay? Very large mirrors, nice, uh, very spacious vanity counter with this gorgeous sink and it comes with a gorgeous bathtub as well with a view. So zooming up, wow, this place really, really well decorated. Marina living condo, sticking to that theme of the Marina lifestyle. I love the color play. I love the furnishing. They did a great job uh, on this one. And again, if you're looking to buy or rent a property anywhere in Thailand, see the links in the description of this video for how to get started. And uh, be sure to subscribe to this channel and check out the videos that just popped up to continue your property search.